One of Lizzie's concert stories. Okay, so, yeah, I'm sitting here telling concert stories, and I brought the Goo Goo Dolls up, and let me tell you what. I had one of the best times ever with them, because uh, when me and my friends got to Cleveland, um, when we got there, we were so brokenhearted because the show was sold out, and we had just drove five hours. We were really upset. And so... We were like, where's the bus? Where's the freaking bus? We're going to try. What? What do we have to lose? You know what I mean? What do we have to lose? So we're going to try to find the bus. We found the bus in the back of the club. We stood there for hours. I'm not kidding. Who was with you? My friend Lisa, Lori. Yeah, just those two. Nobody came with us that time. Lisa and Lori. The two that I don't really talk too much anymore. Anyway, that's another story. But we were standing there, and Robbie, the guitarist, came out from the bus. And we were like, okay, okay. And who gets nominated? To go talk to him. Why? Because I have a mouth. So I walked over, and I said, Robbie. He goes, hey. You know, <laughs> like I scared him or something. I'm thinking, yes, I'm a big, fat girl, okay? Just listen for a second. And I said, um, can I ask you a question? He was like, sure. And I said, okay, we just drove five hours here, and the show was sold out. He said, yes, it is. And I said, and we have no tickets. And he goes, oh, no, that's not good. And I was like, great. He's not going to do anything, you know. He said, okay, this is, this is what I'm going to do. He went on the bus, came back off, had a piece of paper. We were supposed to write our names on the piece of paper. And he said, you will be on the guest list when you get up to the front. Just say, hey, I'm Elizabeth, and my last name, and you'll get in. And I was like, I bet you tell all the girls this, and they go up there, and there's nothing, don't you? <laughs> He said, no, I'm serious. I'm serious. You, you can just go up there, say your name, they'll mark it off, and you can come in for free. I was like, okay. Well, at this time, it was probably 3 in the afternoon, and we had to wait till 7 or 8 that evening when they came on stage. So we, we had went out to eat or something. I can't remember where we went. We went to the front. And, of course, I'm the one that had to look stupid if my name wasn't on there. Elizabeth, you're going first. Elizabeth, you're going first. Of course I am. So I went first, and I said, um, I'm Elizabeth Fletcher, and I'm on the guest list. And she marked my freaking name off. <laughs> and we walked in, right? We got in the front row because we got there early. Of course, we were already there. And... When, we, when they came out on stage, they were like, hey, even Johnny was the lead singer because we had met him in Indianapolis. But, yeah, it was a really, really cool time. It was fun. We were on the guest list. That was one of my fun times. Now, when was the first time you saw Goo Goo Dolls and met them? I went to see Soul Asylum in Indianapolis at the Vogue, and the Goo Goo Dolls were opening up for them. And we saw we were trying to meet Soul Asylum because my friend Lori loved Soul Asylum. And so the guys from the Goo Goo Dolls were outside hanging around. We knew who they were. So I walked up to Johnny, and Johnny was, I mean, we stood there and talked for, I know, an hour. Just about everything. He was talking about his wife being pregnant and this and that, and he was just being really friendly. But... You know, that, that time we just hung out with them and, you know, took pictures of them and everything like that. But this time, because they knew who we were, you know, they remembered us from then. They let us in on the guest list. And then there was another time we saw them in, where was it? It was in Ohio again. Columbus. We saw them in Columbus. And Johnny wanted a picture that I took of him and the drummer. Because I had it and I wanted him to sign it. And of course I gave that away too. Like I gave my button away to Ahmed. But anyway, yeah, that was that was fun. That was Aww. a fun time. She has a million of these concert stories, people. 
I do. It was it was a good time in my life. It really was. Okay. So okay. 